guys, this is Eliza and welcome back to a new video. So today is another small business haul. It's slightly concerning me because this fell out of the bottom corner. And I really hope there's not more of those in there. This is from the Quirky Cup Collective, which I follow on TikTok and I wanted to buy from them for a while and I finally did it. So we open it up and this is what it looks like. It says, hello, you're amazing. Just thought you should know. Um, and their website on the back. There is more confetti in here. I'll just try and not get it everywhere. Let's start with the bookmarks. These come with tassels, which I'm not a huge fan of tassels, but to each their own. So I got three of them. The tassels do have plastic on them, so I'll get that off later. But this is what the first bookmark looks like. It is absolutely stunning. I love this. And they all have gold tassels. Um, but there you go. You can kind of see a little bit better. This one's got like a moth on it. Then we have this one. Oh, there you go. You can kind of see it there. The pink is from my grow lights on my plant stand. Um, that's what that one looks like. And all of them have the same background on the back and it's got the, their logo on the bottom. And the final one looks like this. This one's like a moon one. Absolutely stunning. Stunning. I will be taking the tassels off. I cannot stand tassels. Not just aesthetically, but I just find them really freaking annoying. That's better. Look at that. That's so much better. They're the four bookmarks that I got. I'll chuck on the screen how much they cost because I don't actually know where my phone is right now. We now have the notebook, which I'm going to try and get out without putting the packing peanuts everywhere. Yeah, I'll go that way. Ah, there goes one. Oh no. Oh no. So firstly we have the sticker, which is a little like boba cup type thing with like a galaxy in it. I just thought it was really cute. So that's the sticker. And then the big item per se is a notebook. So I got a dot grid, 160 pages. This is 160 GSM. It has gold foiled edges and it is just beautiful. So let's open this up very slowly. There we go. So yeah, it's got journal written on the back and has their logo, but let's have a look at the actual thing. So this is what it looks like. Oh, it's stunning. Has gold metallic edges and then this one on the back and it says the magic starts here. On the inside cover, this is what it looks like and it's got a place to put this journal belongs to. And then we have just dot grid paper. This is stunning. This is absolutely beautiful. I'm not sure what I'm gonna use this for specifically, but I will definitely find a use for it. It is beautiful. And I decided to go with dot grid because it's like, oh, this is fine too. Because dot grid's kind of like universal. To me, it's universal because like, it's not so in your face that there's lines. So if you wanted to like draw something, you could, but also, you can make lines out of the dots if you want it lined or like just want to follow the lines because I cannot, I cannot write straight, <laughs> like cannot do it. So having the dots gives you like a bit of a guide. I currently use an Archer and Olive journal, which also has 160 GSM paper. So I'm assuming it has the same capabilities that the Archer and Olive does. There you go, that's a really good look at it. That, that angle right there is hitting all the metallic and you can see it. But yeah, cause the Archer and Olive is super thick so you can use even watercolor on Archer and all of it is fine so this should be the same we'll leave them linked down below in their instagram uh, their tiktok handle and all that linked down below so that way you guys can check them out as well so that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll see you in my next one